When we came into this building from our old building, it's kind of like when you go fishing uh, and you go with an old cane pole, which just has a bobber on the end of the line going up to a piece of cane. And then you go to a rod and reel. Uh, you're catching fish either way, but the experience of doing it is very different. Uh, and I can tell you which one I prefer. We went from the old facility where it seated maybe about 400 people to the new facility that we're in now, and it seats about 800. Uh, so there wasn't just a difference of size in the new room, but there was also a difference of what we could do. In the old room, everything that was in there for the most part uh, was done piecemeal over time. Uh, it was never intended to be a long-term solution. Everything from the way that the stage was constructed, the way that cables were routed, the way that the video equipment was set up. We came here and PTG helped us think through every single one of those things so that from the ground up, we had a system that was designed with our desires in mind. One of those desires was to have a green room, a place where we could meet before the service. Another thing was to have multiple monitors throughout our campus where we could see what was going on in the service at any time. Another thing was a lighting system with greater control, things that we could do that we weren't able to do before. And then also having a screen that uh, was very dynamic in terms of how it looked, but was also very useful in terms of being able to do different things at different moments in the service. The other thing would just be a quality sound system. The, the, the sound system we've got in here is light years away. And that's the funny thing with technology, it just keeps changing over time. And so with this facility, as the technology changes, we can change with it. We interviewed several AVL companies leading up to this build. Uh, what stood out about PTG was one, they had a standing relationship with BGW, which was the design build firm that did this. Uh, they were in from the ground floor as a result of that. I've seen a lot of uh, times where AVL is more of an afterthought. And this was from the foundation, built and in, baked into the whole process. Uh, PTG was on board. So they were helping builders, uh, designers, architects think through our needs as a church from the very beginning. All the staff is very professional, very kind. Uh, very timely in responding to questions. Uh, the person I dealt with the most is Misa Loya. He was the uh, kind of site director when they were here. And Misa has made way more trips here, I think, than were initially planned because uh, there were things that needed to be fixed or addressed and Misa was on top of it. Uh, he saw things through to the end until we were done and really showed a dedication to making sure the customer, us in this case, uh, was pleased with the final product. So if you're looking to utilize AVL in your church, I would say hire PTG because they're going to help you think through all of the things that go into a building. And I'm gonna warn you, you need to prepare and think about things more than you think you need to. Uh, come visit our church if you can. Take a look at the work they did and see the finished product. Uh, you'll be amazed at what you see.